Pudding cup, there you are. Hey, um, is there something you want to tell me? Yes, you had no screen time for the whole last episode, except for the intro. You know how bad that is? People can vote you off for shit like that. Well, don't blame me. It's the creator's fault that I didn't have a role last episode. Oh well, I'll try to be more participative this episode. Honestly, you should. This is all your fault, shame. Sorry. Well, the first team to be up for elimination this season, how does it feel? Well, we would have easily won if Orby never had a bulletproof shield and could shoot out of her mouth and massacred our almost whole fucking team. Alright, let's just get on with it, shall we? Okay, so this is how the elim- Yeah, 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 whatever, we're not the first object shared to have one. Well. Looks like we have a bitchy contestant here. So, we got a total of four votes. Yeah, that's not a lot. One has only one, while the other has the rest. And we're just gonna find out the two people who got those votes. So, all contestants safe are... Stick, bowling ball, orange ball, chalk, sack bag, seed, flashlight, mechanical pencil, and oaky. I told you you could get voted off for shit like that. Cancel this series now. Okay. No, 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 no. One has only one, while the other has three. And the one safe is... Slimy. <laughs> and this is why you should include every character in your episode. I'm new to script and storytelling, okay? No, no you're not. Wait, where do you send Pudding Cup? The BBC? Wait, you mean my area's BBC? No way! She's gonna be seen live nationally! Not that BBC, the other BBC. The Big Blue Container. Oh fuck me. Today's contest is to make your way across the Goiki Canal. The challenge is divided into two parts. The first being on motor, and the second being on boat. Both teams have both their transportation devices all set. Whoever's team makes it to the other side wins immunity. Go. So, me, being the co-leader, I will tell you all to listen to Yoyo Cake for his genius plan. We are god- <laughs> Alright, I didn't understand a word from him other than we are god- Hey, don't insult our leader like that. Now keep your mouth shut for the rest of the challenge. Ugh! Let's just get the fuck in already and stop wasting such fucking time! Wow, someone seems pretty grumpy. I'm sorry! Can someone help me up the ramp? I don't want to slide down. I could do it. I'm the strongest after all. Woo! I just got my driver's license, so I'm gonna be the one driving. Oh wow! So you're just gonna give us rolls now? Shut up and buckle your fucking seatbelt. And who the fuck do you think you're talking to with that shit tone of voice? <laughs> Google ham. Please let this be a normal ride. With the oil cake? Hell nah! <laughs> I'm like hungry. Same queen? Like, quartz? Go get us some fucking food. Nah, I'm like, too lazy. Get us some food, or else I will fucking pummel you with all my rings on and demote you to a member. Okay... Excuse me, do you have any food? No, we don't. I am very sorry. Please give us some food or else Lava Lamp will pummel me. Try asking someone else. Maybe they have food on them. Fine. 
Excuse me, umbrella. If you ever hurt me again, I will fucking murder you and cook you along with your entire bloodline. TNT. What? Do you have any food? What makes you think I have food? Huh? I was just asking. Fuck off! You good, MP? Yeah, why? Just asking, are you still pissed at playing Cup Gang Eliminate for not having any scream time last episode? No? I mean, it's not her fault that we got up for elimination last episode. Stick seemed to be doing pretty well for our team until Orby decided to ruin it for us. Oh, okay. Yo, look how ass the other team is at driving. I can't look right now. I'm driving myself and I need to concentrate. Come on, just look. No. Just look. No. Please. No. Just. No. I. No. <laughs> Thanks, a 2,763 trillion flashlight. Now our fucking car is fuckingly on fucking fire. If already being up for elimination this episode wasn't bad enough. Uh, whatever. Thankfully, all three of us escaped quickly. You know how bad getting set up on fire could be for us. Can we at least take a quick stop at the mini mart while we have the others beat us? Uh-uh. Yo. <laughs> Where's my, like, snack? I couldn't get any. What? You know what this means, right? You will be demoted to a member, understand? Fine. Rubber deads. Finally, we're here. Now time to get onto the boat. Finally, we're done walking. Now time to get onto the boat. Nice! Phone's all the way behind us! What's your beef with Phone? What did he do to you? He's an asshole! Really? I remember talking to Phone once and he seemed fine to me. What? That's it! I'm not talking to you anymore! Fuck off! So, you're just gonna start ignoring me all because I talk to someone you hate? Wow, so fucking mature of you. <sighs> Such 12-year-old behavior. Oh my, I've never seen TNT sad before. I don't know if I should. No, I gotta help my teammate. Hey, TNT, are you okay? You seem quite more down than usual. Is there something that's been bothering you lately? <sighs> It's just that I've been sick of getting all steamed up lately. I became more self-aware of how bad my anger issues are and how I've made an impact on others. Every day it just hurts to see someone either scared of me or make fun of me. And I really want to change my attitude so others won't see me in a bad light. But it's just too hard for me to do so. Well... I'm actually surprised that you're willing to change. You see, there was a time when I had anger problems. When I was in around 5th grade, around the time BFB happened. It's not just that. I've been having this problem my entire life. Oh. Gently down scream? Does this kid even know how to steer a boat? So, what I want you to do is to swing Bowling Ball down to Phone's boat and slam it till he becomes a 21st century Titanic. Anything to make us win. Me and Orby are not related. Woo! We made it! Well, what's happened over here? Our team just won the challenge! Well, where's the rest of your team? Oh, they all died on that boat. But don't worry, we all have a recovery center on the other side of the canal. Say, do you know any way to go back to the other side? Well, you don't have to know since we're staying here from now on. You're lucky because your team still won the challenge from your boat passing the finish line. Vote for any member of Team Hairspray. Hey. 
I like your voice. What the flea, bro?